everyone, welcome to the English news edition brought to you live from RTD channel. The headlines for tonight are The head of state, Marlon Margile, presides over the ceremony of the wall held day. And on the continental news, wall a health day strengthen a health system and should finance key uh, to achieving health for all. Let's get into the details. And now, the head of state, Milo Margili, continued today, Sunday in the afternoon, at the presidential palace, the working meeting with the high national administration, and supposedly leading to the realization of a better service for Jewish public. This afternoon, the main theme was justice in our country, which is a priority to improve the rule of law. A discussion focused on the functioning of the justice system, which uh, faces uh, uh, challenges. First of all, uh, the slowness uh, that remains to become a hindrance for good governance. The members of the government, including Prime Minister Abdul Qadir Kaba Mohammed, the Minister of Justice, the Minister of the Interior, the Minister of the Republic, participated in the uh, debate uh, this afternoon, which focused mainly on justice. The judicial family took part in the round table in uh, the presence, of course, of the Secretary General of the Justice, the Attorney General of the uh, Republic, the President of the Judicial Institution, including the Supreme Court, the Court of Auditors, the Court of Freestance, the Court of Cassation, the Court of uh, Personal they all spoke about the situation and respond to the concern and needs of uh, litigants effectively. The uh, head of state, Milo Morgilli, did not fail to ask the main actors of justice urgent actions. Uh, it is necessary to sensitize uh, the general public and also to manage to use the new technologies for a better efficiency. The head of state, Milo Morgilli, in this important reunion, talked about how and in which way uh, those in charge of the justice should answer to the the needs and provide in the best ways and requested solution to the Jewish uh, population. Today, said the, the uh, head of state, the theme of the day is the justice uh, close to the uh, citizens and to the service of development. The justice is a servant public service, said the uh, head of state. In our country, the function of justice uh, face uh, many challenges, the main ones uh, uh, being uh, the result of of slow procedures without the affirmation of a fair, transparent and effective justice, there is no serenity and possible cohesion of our uh, society, said, it, said the head of state. Our justice must uh, quickly remedy the slowness that characterizes it, he said. It must also remedy uh, the lack of uh, drafting and clarity in the judgment. Uh, he demand also President Gilly immediately urge our uh, main justice officials to bear understand the improvement of their uh, services through a greater use of new information as well as uh, communication uh, technologies known, known as uh, ICTs. He also ordered the immediate start of an efficient process of collaboration between uh, them. It is uh, by putting in place a transparent system and a face uh, a path of execution of the files that our country will be on the way to success the best of uh, modern uh, justice. He indicated the uh, head of state not uh, satisfied that the many uh, reforms adapted to improve the living as well as working condition of our magistrates have not optimally generated the expected professional performance. Achieving justice that meets international standards is no longer a luxury accessory for our society, said the head of state. It is a key piece in our system to drain uh, many foreign investors that requires our development, uh, pointing out finally at the head of state. Another news, uh, the head of state, uh, like uh, the Republic of Djibouti, like the world, celebrate World Health Day. Uh, this day, placed under the high patronage of uh, the President of the Republic, Ismailo Margile, uh, was organized by the Ministry of Health in close collaboration with the State Secretariat for Social Affairs, as well as the National uh, Social Security Fund, known as CNSS. Uh, the theme of the day at the People's Palace was uh, Universal Health Council wage for all and everyone. On his arrival, the uh, head of state accompanied by uh, the first lady, Khadra Mohammed uh, Hayed, were welcomed by the Prime Minister Abdul Qadir Kamil Mohammed and the Minister of Health, Dr. Jamal Mokiye. The head of state, Milo Margili, visited uh, the various standards that mark uh, the various uh, development in health with the sole objective of serving uh, the people of Djibouti. The ceremony 
uh, begin with the reading of the Holy Quran, followed with the dances and folk songs. The day, the day saw the participation of uh, the Minister of Foreign Affairs, International uh, Cooperation, the Minister of Justice, the Minister of Energy, the Minister of Decentralization, the Secretary of State for Social Affairs, the Minister of Budget, the Minister of Telecommunication, the Minister of Housing, uh, the various corps of the Army, as well as diplomatic corps resident in Djibouti, as well as uh, many MPs. As we remind that universal health coverage is about ensuring that all individuals and communities uh, receive the health services they need without experiencing a financial uh, hardship. Of course, it uh, encompasses service for entire uh, Djibouti uh, populations. In his speech, in his speech on the sidelines of the World Health Day ceremony, the head of state, Madam Magili, said, and I quote, uh, "Ladies and gentlemen, it is a real pleasure for me to be uh, here today to address a theme that appeals to me, in particular, universal health coverage. Everywhere and for all, starting a few years ago, a deep reflection on the health sector, a challenge seemed crucial to me, that of restoring social justice, fairness, balance, as well." Finally, uh, the confidence of Djibouti and in their health system. The reform that we started with the introduction of uh, universal health insurance was intended to leave uh, no Djibouti aside when it comes to access to care, whatever it is financial situation or its uh, uh, proximity to appropriate care uh, for these uh, while other countries are more uh, wealthy refuse uh, to do we made uh, the brave choice uh, to systemize uh, the third party permit in order to stop the direct permit which represented a barrier uh, to care for a large part of our population it is therefore important to reiterate today uh, the importance of solidarity as uh, the basis of our health system and to continue to work in such a way that exclusion no longer has any place. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, it is uh, pleasing to me that our wish to see the neediest uh, to have greater access to health care is on track to be achieved with the actions presented here today. However, let's bear in mind that this uh, solidarity is made possible only uh, by the contribution of a rather small part of our uh, fellow citizens uh, that is in health insurance. Everything rests on a balance uh, that uh, if we want more generosity, it must go hand in hand with the principle of justice. It is therefore normal that everyone can contribute to health insurance at the head of their means. The system must accommodate all social professional categories, including the informal sector, which occupies a significant part of our economy. Moreover, it is in this context that an initial scheme has been introduced to accommodate the contributory portion of the 
is a self-employed person. For now, its size remains crucial to expand access to care because it concerns a large segment of our population that is very vulnerable to disease risk because it is often composed of self-employed people who cannot afford uh, that illness deprive them of uh, their work. Also, I urge our fellow citizens working under the independent status uh, to come and, and make sure to ensure their family in order to guard against uh, the risk of disease factor of uh, disability and impoverishment. All means must be implemented to facilitate their registration wherever they are, but still contribution solution adapted to their financial condition must uh, be systemically system Automatically proposed in the of uh, court. Pursuing his speech, the uh, head of state uh, said in a quote, uh, ladies and gentlemen, on this uh, solemn day uh, celebrating our country's uh, health effort, I wanted to remind you uh, to a much uh, greater extent that uh, to continue to improve our health care system, we need to more decisively toward prevention and improvement of public health indicators, indeed, for the well-being of our population and in order to sustain our system of solidarity financing, uh, Preventive measures uh, must be at the heart of the health system. It is therefore cr critical that uh, prevention strategies uh, become an essential part of, of caregiving. Uh, doctors are traditionally trained to treat the disease rather than prevent it. So reversing uh, the strain is not so easy, but good, ga uh, good uh, preventive care at all stages of life helps our uh, fellow citizens stay healthy, avoid or delay uh, the onset sets of illness and prevent disease from becoming worse or disabling lead productive lives and reduce costs. Therefore, I urge you to uh, set up a prevention system that takes into account the screening of different types of cancer, the prevention of long-term conditions such as uh, diabetes and high blood pressure, vaccination, and even for adults uh, pre as well uh, postnatal uh, follow-ups. Uh, this is the a sense of community-based care, but also the importance of reliable statistics and public health studies that will focus our resource and efforts on the most urgent and vital issues. I would like to end uh, my speech by thanking all the health staff for their outstanding work on a daily basis and on behalf of the Republic to express uh, their gratitude to them. Uh, thank you and end of quote. In his intervention in Somali, the head of state, Smaila Mugale, did not fail to congratulate the Ministry of uh, uh, Health for the quality of health for all. Health has, has a cost starting by the staff of the Ministry of Health that must be valued but also provide them with adequate uh, technical platform for better performance in favor of uh, the Jewish population. We must constantly adapt, said the uh, head of state, to health technology evolution and access new treatments that professors or scientists discover every year. Everyone uh, must benefit from health benefits regardless of their social, racial and color uh, category, uh, said the head of state. The development of uh, a country depends on uh, the good health conditions of its uh, fellow citizens. Uh, the health services must uh, cover the whole country and especially with the CNSS score and it is necessary, uh, said, the, said the head of state, to have access score to the health uh, centers or uh, they will benefit from free uh, consultations. And after the various speeches, an award uh, ceremony was held uh, for the staff uh, who worked with uh, bravery and honor by serving uh, other uh, during their years of uh, services. And let's remind that uh, the Republic of Djibouti, uh, like uh, the rest of the world, celebrate uh, today uh, the, the World Health a day. So the ceremony uh, saw the participation, uh, let's remind, with the participation of uh, uh, the members of the government, including the uh, ministers of uh, the Foreign Affairs, the Minister of Decentralization, the Minister for the Solidarity, as well the Minister of Budget, as well the uh, Communication ones. Uh,
the wall uh, held a day and he said that it's a real pleasure for uh, him to be uh, to participate at this uh, huge ceremony As the wall uh, commemorates the World Health Day, the World Health Organization has a threat that effective uh, leadership and high-level political commitment are critical to achieving universal uh, health coverage. Uh, WHO's uh, original director for Africa, uh, Dr. Madis Tu Moiti, stated th uh, this at the World Health Day a briefing by the organization in Abuja uh, yesterday. He said even though access to treatment and social uh, services had uh, improved in the African region over uh, the years, uh, much more needed to be done to curb the increase in non-communicable uh, disease uh, epidemics like uh, Ebola and uh, cholera. So that's it for the news. Thanks for being with us on RTD Channel Line.